Welcome to 54 Football X. Mike the Pondit here, ready to assess for you the Super Eagles squad. 23 man squad as released by the interim manager of the Super Eagles. Speaking of Austin Eguavo. Let's begin from the goalkeeping position. This squad list is a list that is meant to trade tackles with the Libyan national team over two legs. The first leg will be at the Nest of Champions in New York this Friday, while the return leg would be happening away from home next week. So let's begin from the goalkeeping position. Three goalkeepers have been called up, and that is goalkeepers are Stanley Wabali, Madika Okoye, and Amas Obasoji. In all fairness, I think uh, the goalkeeping position is actually what we can make do with at this point of in time. Madika Okoye is in good form with Udinese, while Stanley Wabali has also been very, very instrumental to the Super Eagles in these qualifiers. A little bit of eyebrows have been raised as we got a mass of Basoji that that position is actually meant for the goalkeepers in the NPFL. But then he's now been called up, but only Osuna Bravon can actually explain that. But I think Osuna Bravon, as far as this video would go on, has stood to the best of legs as we got those that worked with him last time out and also bringing them this particular time. So let's go on and check on the defenders. We've got defenders. Williams is the captain of the side, like you know it. Um, Bright Osai uh, Samuel, and there is Bruno Yemechi, Oluwa Shemilo Guajai, Calvin Basi, Olo Oluwa Aino, and Tanimu Benjamin. The eyebrows as regards the defender position is actually with Tanimu Benjamin. Many are saying that, oh, he's a League 2 player, he's uh, playing in the lower division of English football, why are you trying to invite him and all of that. But then, he was also part of the qualifiers, even with the Canadian judge at that point in time, and now with uh, Austin Eguavo. Uh, the midfielders that we've got, uh, Wilfred Inidi, Rafael Onyedika, Alassane Yusu, Frank Onyeka, Alex Iwobi, and Fisayo Dede Bashir. Bashir is in good form with Lazio right there in Italy. And I think these midfielders are exactly what we expected. Like I said in the start of this video, they still the same way in which um, Austin Eguavo really wants to play. I think he's trying to play the safe card by inviting the players that got him four points from a possible six. Just tell them in camp, guys, you know how we did it last time out. Let's even do one more better. We won one and drew one. Now we can actually win the two games and just qualify for the Afghan. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, no problem. Let's move forward to the forwards now, really. Ademola Lukman, Kidera Ejuki, Kelechi Yanachov, Samuel Chikweze, Moses Simon, Victor Boniface, Taiwo Awuni. Like you know, the big news is that there is no Victor Osime. Osime says he would return after the international break due to injury. And replacing him is Chidera Ejuke. Chidera Ejuke has got the most take-ons in the La Liga and many are clamored for him to be invited. Finally, he has now been invited. Also, many are saying that Samuel Chico is sent not to be developing and the wise also being invited. But we're looking forward to a very, very big one with uh, the one they call Banga Boy. And that's speaking of Victor Boniface. Victor, hopefully, will be able to shine with the Super He was very, very close last time out against the Republic and also against the Rwanda. So this squad, this 23 man squad is for me, for Mike the Pundit, I think it's good enough because you just have to get over the line and just uh, qualify for the African Cup of Nations. There is no time for experiment. Trust us at 54 Football X, we will bring you all of the content as you guys this game. That's why you need to follow us across our social media platforms to get more from these particular qualifiers. Mike the Pundit, signing out.